feel of like creating a song? How do you come up with a song? Um, and so with that, uh, I actually have a uh, line of uh, songs that, you know, I have already, but to break it down, I tell you how I actually create a song. Um, so my process on creating a song is basically uh, using a, uh, um, there's several AI uh, products out there that you can actually use. Uh, Chat GPT is the basic one. Um, but what you want to do when you are creating a song is basically, you know, uh, form an ideal in your head and basically think about what do you want to hear or what do you want to actually give to the people you want to uh, listen to your music. Um, such as me, um, I think about what do I like? The whole key is what do I like? If I like it and feel it, um, the universe is large, huge, <laughs> big. And so if I like it and have that feel, I know definitely it's some more people out there should have that same feel that I'm uh, actually having or reacting to it. And so um, once you finish your music and, you know, put it out there, um, of course, if uh, this AI uh, music is new, uh, hopefully in the future it actually catch up, um, you know, to like where the industry hopefully to go uh, with AI music. Um, even though we still have like the regular artists out here doing their thing. So, you know, it is what it is. Uh, but let's get to this process. So um, first thing as soon as you want to look at um, the lyrics. Let's let's walk through Suno. So when you enter uh, Suno.com, uh, you, you come to this screen here. You have the home create. Uh, let me slow down. You have the home page, which is what you see here. And then you have like, you see where your creative side at, the library create is where you actually enter your lyrics and so on. And uh, once you put the lyrics, let, let me grab some lyrics. And um, I like using my own lyrics. I, I don't care for generating. You can actually just put, uh, let's see. Love of my life. And once you put that in there, uh, you can actually have uh, AI to basically generate your uh, song off of the love of your life. Uh, you can actually go in and actually uh, put more into the song. You can actually format it uh, totally different for from what uh, Sono actually would give you. Um, actually, once it gives you the uh, format of what you just asked for, it will give you something you know, uh, according to whatever uh, generates there. Uh, the next thing is the style. All right, so what type of music, um, what type of genre of music do you like? Um, so uh, for me, I'm gonna just put Afro beats. And so with Afro beats, um, you can get more in depth with uh, Afro beats or you can get more in depth with uh, country or, you know, pop or whatever you feel uh, your nature. And so uh, understanding that I like Afro beats. So what type of instruments do, you know, I like to hear my music? Um, me personally, I do research to see, you know, uh, because I'm, I just really got into, uh, well, I've been around the music industry damn near all my life uh, with filming, uh, but just starting uh, music is uh, one of the newer things that I'm doing because um, I'm not a really good singer, I barely can sing, but with this AI technology, um, it can actually make you look like a star, which I don't want to be that star. I want to actually stay behind the scenes and make great, great music and um, love for people to listen to the music that I'm creating uh, with uh, Suno. Uh, there's more AI products out there. Um, 
I fell in uh, the liking of Suno early on. And one thing I do know from my experience is you want to stick to um, one thing and perfect that one thing before you want to jump to all of these different uh, softwares out there, AI softwares out there, because what it will do is basically have you confused by the sounds that you are hearing or this one is better than that one. But if you find a great, great product uh, such as uh, Sono and seeing how they constantly update uh, their product to make it better and better, um, to me, you really, as of right now, you really don't need anything else um, because of the fact of they're doing uh, exactly what uh, a company, a small company, I don't know if it's a small or big company, but a company should do uh, when it's actually creating its products for the people. And so um, it's really good. It's really good. Uh, I've learned a lot. Um, I've been on Suno now for <laughs> probably four or five months, um, almost from the beginning. From uh, Actually, they have uh, the version uh, V2. I started using V2. And then V3, and now uh, they have uh, recently upgraded. Uh, it's been a while, 3.5, um, and it's like really good. And so, you know, I've had the experience to actually see how they actually growing uh, this uh, software here. And to me, it's possibly going to be one of the best out there. And with that said, we'll get back like to the styles. Uh, just say, for instance, uh, I'm going to play around. I'm going to just grab some styles that I already have created. Um, like me, I put like Nigerian Afro beats, um, hip hop, um, contemporary trap, uh, smooth. Uh, these are like words that uh, I think that will enhance this song that I'm trying to create. Um, and, you know, hopefully uh, the song actually come out according to the way I like it. I would tell you another thing, uh, dealing with styles of uh, music, I'm the type of person love to do the opposite of what I see uh, others do. So I try to just put uh, certain styles of uh, uh, certain genres and mix them up to see what type of feel or what type of music I can actually come up with or what AI will actually uh, generate for me. Um, because we always got to remember that anyone can create, but it takes a crazy mind to be a, uh, a new creator, if you get what I'm saying. But all right, so we did the style. And then if you want, you can put like the title because I had um, Suno to actually generate it. It actually put a title there. And so after the title, uh, you just actually go for create. And with the create uh, part of it, you just wait for a minute. And after the wait process, you just um, do what you want to do. Uh, hello. Uh, let's see. And now, so it have created the uh, song. And let's listen to the song. Hopefully, you guys can actually hear it really good. Love of my life, you lay up my light. With every smile, you chase away fright. In your eyes, I see stars burning so bright. Love of my life, you make it all right. Heart beats racing to your sweet tune. Every moment with you ends too soon. In your arms, feels like a warm tune. And another thing, uh, when you ge generate your songs, it actually generates two songs at one time. And so you actually have that that second flavor. And so if you don't like the first song, uh, and um, you can listen to the second song, which is this is the second song. <laughs> Thank you. 
So I actually like the second version. Um, and so what I do now is um, I'll look over the whole song. I go back and replay it about five or six times. I listen to it. And from there, I start breaking out the words that I don't like uh, in there. I remove like, let's let's go through it. So I'm going to start the whole process of the clip. And as the song playing, you will actually see me uh, take like words out or replace them with something else to make it actually uh, fit for what I like. I don't care for lit up my night, so I'm just keep uh, uh, love of my life in there. And uh, we'll go back. See, with every smile you ch chase with my flight, what the freak? Um, so every smile you chase away. What's another word for fright? Let's see. So I'm doing this like live in front of all of y'all, uh, whoever watches it. And so I'm trying to come off the hip and actually think about it. Uh, let's keep going. I'm gonna go back again. <laughs> so bright um in your eyes you see stars burn i don't I, it, it irritates me but you know that is part of the process um in your eyes i see stars burning so bright i'm gonna just say i see stars i'm removing that bright uh, love of my life let's keep going Heart brace racing to your sweet tune. Heart brace racing. I don't need the sweet tune in there. So it doesn't it's more ai words and so what you're basically doing is moving the ai words uh that you don't care for or you constantly hear over it over it. um when you start to do that you um if you start to actually use uh products like suno and others you are start generating your music using ai you will actually start to um hear these words over and over and that no that lets you know that you definitely got to uh, if you really want to stand out you you must uh, change those type of uh, words and um, make it uh, in a way you love it and other people will enjoy it so let's continue <laughs>
I'll let it stay for right now. We're going to continue. some basic parts right and so now I will take this uh, this song right here and then I actually have a uh, software that generates it's sort of like uh, chat GPT and what I would do is this right here I'm giving y'all some great uh, information um, so I asked the software generate a call and response into this song leave all lyrics the same and so now i've added a call and respond into this song and so now i copy the song um, and then paste it here and remove all the unnecessary. And I will, I got all the uh, uh, words that I didn't care for out and uh, regenerated and asked AI uh, to keep it uh, without God, but make it add, uh, add a call and response in. And so with that, we'll regenerate this song. All right, so the song is through gener regenerate. Now let's go back. Thank you. 
to leave alone in your melody my strong but keep singing second one sound like. compared to the ones now. actually understand some of this software um, or understand Suno and uh, understand the basis of music. And um, instead of being afraid of this technology, uh, start adapting it and try to actually learn as much as possible. Because one thing I do know, if you don't do it, someone else will. All right, so let's continue. All right, so Sono actually have a, it's in beta test called um, covers. And so you can like right click on it and go up to create and you want to cover some. And so what, what cover is, is basically um, from the way I understand it, it actually covered this, uh, the song that you just done. And it'll keep that rhythm sort of the same but say for instance let's let's do a cover on this song i'm gonna just put in like um blues southern soul and uh we'll generate this song into a blues and southern song and then you see exactly what i mean about cover you also have the your same lyrics um, it's pretty amazing uh, how this software is working. Um, let's see here. All right, so I just did the cover. It just finished, so let's see what it sounds like. Sound like. 
Still in beta, so it gave uh, one as a bluesy, and then the second one it gave the uh, the original. Uh, I'm gonna just take uh, blues out and just use Southern Soul and see what we come up with. Another thing, guys, uh, I'm not used to actually like talking to nobody i don't feel I, i'm not you guys but it feels like i'm talking to a screen which make me feel like why am i doing this um but you know hopefully you guys enjoy it and it inspire me to continue to do it because i've learned a lot uh i keep it all right here um i love to share some of it but uh when I'm sharing it and I don't see like people watching what I'm talking about. Uh, maybe I need to frame, uh, reframe the way I actually give out information, but I am who I am. So, I mean, you know, um, hopefully, you know, you guys leave comments, share and like, um, and that will inspire me to actually continue to give a lot of the models that I ran across because there's a lot of tricks and trades uh using this uh system this ai uh, music uh, generator and not only that i mean from images to videos um to from even uh the chat gpts and all of that so i definitely have a lot of knowledge when it comes to um the ai um game of uh generating and creating uh, by the way, if you guys like go to my uh, look at my uh, front uh, page on my YouTube channel, um, you will see uh, a lot of the music that I've created uh, using AI. And uh, let's see what this sound like. Another thing that you can actually do, you can actually add, uh, upload your voice. Actually, uh, you can record your voice. Um, I'll give you all a sample. I can't really sing, but I'll give you a sample. Let's see. In the love of my life, let's see here. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. Maybe if you guys uh, like and leave in the comment that uh, the next time I go live, I'll do it then. What about that? Uh, you never get a good layup out of me unless you uh, ask, ask, actually ask me. So, um, no, I'm not going to say that. I can sing. All right. 
but uh, let me know in the comment what what you think. Uh, should I should I not? But you can actually go here and you can actually upload a song that you already have, or you can actually uh, use your own voice. And so, using your own voice, uh, as you can see uh, there. Uh, let's see. We're gonna go out of that. Um, another thing is uh, you also have like your lyrics layout here of your song. Um, and it also gives you like the image um, that you can actually uh, use. Uh, what I mean about that, let, let's, I don't know if it's going to show my uh, information, but if you click on like where your credits uh, is located, uh, you see like the uh, the free version, which free version you don't have any rights to. Uh, the pro and premier version you actually have you know the rights to be able to do whatever you want with your music. Um, that is very important to know uh, when you do um, log on and start creating songs. Um, I did some uh, deep digging uh, about you know the rights of uh, creating this music. Um, like I say, they also have um, over here where you can go like to create, you can do the extend. Uh, let me show you what extend uh, uh, does. So say for instance, uh, you click on it, you go like, right you can either uh, right click, let's see, right click, or you can just go to the three dots over here and then you can go down go over to extend you can extend extend you'll see it right here and so if you want to extend the song say basically what you're doing is copying copying the uh pattern of that song with the lyrics and all of that right and so uh what you want to do is uh put it down lower it depends on how long you want to extend uh this your next song uh, you can go to like zero you take that minute out and then you will put a zero here and so it'll store like i just show you for example where we're stored at for you can have a idea of uh, the song instead of it starting it from the beginning if you go up here, uh, actually it did start uh, from the beginning. Sometimes it doesn't start from the beginning. Uh, Sometimes it depends on where you uh, start the extend from. So say for instance, if I uh, put one minute in there, uh, then you do the extend. <laughs> So now you saw you see how it actually starts in part of the song. And so say for instance, if you have lyrics from uh, that you want to add on, if you actually use the 300 uh, characters up um, and you need to, to extend and you need the same uh, the same beat and all of that, uh, what you want to do is uh, try to match uh, where, how much you need. And then uh, understand, you know, how many lyrics you want to put in to actually get that extension. Uh, it also extend up to uh, I think two minutes is the max as of uh, uh, right now. And uh, with that, uh, let's see exactly where it did it start at. In the melody, my heart is strong. We'll keep singing. Your laughter is the music that fills my soul. With you around, I always feel. If you notice it, the maxed out at uh, two minutes, and so that's where it maxed out at. So that means that song could have been possibly longer. Um, and so you have to balance it out and sort of start working with the software to understand, um, you know, what you need and how you need it and uh, go from there let's see here i will get out of that 
All right, so I mean, from what I've showed you is some of the basics um, and my way of uh, explaining. Um, just, you know, coming off the hip and just wanting to do something on this. Uh, we're waiting on the hurricane and uh, pray that we don't get hit hard. Uh, Milton. I'm glad it's not Milton Freeman, but Milton is uh, coming our way. And we're like, in the path of it, uh, we're like in the uh, Wesley Chapel area. So knock on wood. Um, that's basically it. If um, you guys, please do me a favor. If you guys uh, think I should continue doing this, uh, just let me know in the chat um, and then I can get more organized and really um, um, laying it out uh, the way it should be laid out uh, when it comes to uh, explaining. But if I don't see any comments, you know, I'm going to just keep me making my music and uh, pushing it out there. And um, one day I will get that. AI hit, <laughs> y'all will see me behind the scenes doing a lot more than what uh, is expected. My goal as of right now is to stick with Suno uh, because uh, from just tampering with the other softwares out there, uh, Suno is on their A game when it comes to um, really perfecting uh, the music that is hopefully going to be in the future. Uh, from here and from AI, AI said it's going to be the music of the future. And so who knows? Only time will tell. And uh, hopefully I'll be a part of that as uh, I continue to learn and grow. So thank you all for watching. Thank you all for hitting that like, uh, share, or subscribe. Whatever you all feel like doing, please do it. Um, and I'll talk to you later. Oh, by the way, could you all share my music? Thank you.